Final Surge is the coaching app we use at New Levels Coaching to set all our athletes training, including setting our training plans. Its cutting edge technology allows us as coaches to set the best possible training for the athletes that we work with. So it's easy to follow, it's easy to use, and it syncs to your watch if you have it set up correctly. I'm gonna go through a quick tutorial to show you how you can best use Final Surge, particularly when you're using your mobile phone. The first cool feature is the calendar feature. If you notice right now, the calendar feature is set on daily, but we can change that to view the week as a whole. We click this top button to the right hand side, just next to the plus button, and then that gives us a calendar view so we can see everything that's planned in the week. The little symbols represent the activities that we have set as a coaching team for you on that designated day. What's cool about Final Surge is you can go into those activities to see descriptions, attachments, and even the workout builders that have been programmed to help you best manage your training sessions and so you know exactly what training you need to do on the set days. If we click onto those symbols, not only do we put descriptions in here as well as the session purpose, we all ha also have these video attachments down here that you can click on to help you understand the effort that you should be putting into your training. This is our RPE scale. This has been designed by our coaching team to help you understand the training zones and to help you to understand what effort levels you should be putting into your training when you're completing your training plan. At the bottom, we also have the workout builder feature. This is currently connected to Garmin Connect and Final Surge are working hard to make sure it connects with other watches such as Sunto and Coros. If you collect, connect your Garmin Connect to Final Surge and you have it set up correctly, these workouts will automatically pull through to your Garmin so you know exactly what training you need to do on that set day by just clicking your training calendar on your Garmin watch. Make sure that you've watched the tutorials on Final Surge to see how to set this up correctly. If we go back to our calendar view, we'll also notice other activities, not just the running on the plan, whether this rest days, whether it's strength and conditioning. And again, the idea behind this is that we can add video attachments here and videos for you to follow so that you know exactly what strength, what stretching, what mobility work to do in your program. And it's easy to follow tutorials at the click of your finger so you can complete these in your own time, even in the comfort of your own home. These sessions have been designed by our coaching team to help runners to build stronger bodies and also to keep on top of all those little extras around the training. You may also notice little symbols like the love heart or the square notepad. If we click onto the square notepad, you'll see some more information on things such as fueling and nutrition guidance. We use links from our partners, particularly people like Precision Hydration, to help you to understand better how you can be fueling, especially as you start to go longer. Be sure to read all of this information to help you understand better how you can be fueling both before and after your runs, as well as during those runs. You can scroll along the calendar to see what you have planned in future. You can also scroll back and you can also edit your workouts to make notes on them to keep track of your training log. By doing this, this will help you to understand how you felt on those days and it's a really good tool for going back and reflecting on your workouts. If you click the top three dots at the top and click edit, you'll be able to update your workout once it's been pulled through from your watch and you can simply say how you felt, whether it's great, perceived effort, and you can add all different types of things down here, including the weather, as well as some additional metrics. This is your training log. It's important for you to keep this up to date because it's a really good tool that you can reflect on to help you to look back at when you felt good, maybe when you're feeling a little bit tired, and that will help you to work around your training, especially as you're going into races. The one thing that you might want to play around with is your profile on Final Surge. By clicking more in the bottom right hand corner and going down to account and workout settings, you can play around with your profile and your account on here and you can even add a photo. You can also go into user preferences on here. These user preferences are the preferences that you would prefer, particularly things like the measurement units, the time display, as well as the start of the week. Some people like to start their week on a Sunday. Others prefer to start it on a Monday. You can change that by simply clicking on here and choosing the best day for you. All these can be changed. What I would say is just be careful with how much you do change on here, particularly around the structured workouts and the zones. We have carefully planned the training zones and paces for people on training plans, and we've used our coaching knowledge to create a new levels coaching pacing chart, and we've applied these pacing charts to specific training plans so that all the hard work is done for you. 
If you ever want to get in touch with us, you can simply use the mailbox feature. If you click onto the mailbox, you'll see what inbox messages you have, but you can also send a message by pressing on the plus, putting your subject line in the top, and putting your message to our coaching team. This is the fastest and easiest way to reach our coaching team and they will do their best to get back to you within 24 hours. If it's a weekend message, then it's more likely to be in the working week. If you ever see any notifications pop up at the top, that means you've probably got a message back from our coaching team. You'll see that you've sent a message or received a message and that's come through to your inbox, which you can click back on the mailbox feature to see any mailbox messages that you may not have read or opened. Hopefully that gives you an insight into how to use Final Surge, particularly on your mobile phone and all the cool features that are on here to help you enjoy your training so that you can train smarter and race faster.